Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back. As always, it is me, Molt. So happy to be here with you guys today, as always. And as you can see from my army camp, we have a very interesting raid coming up. That's right, guys. The last one is about to finish up. We have 40 hog riders, and we have five of them in the clan castle. So we are going... Oh, four of them. Yeah. So we are going to have a 44 hog rider raid, and I believe that that was the last... Yep, that was the last hog rider right there. So my camp is now full. We have 44 hog riders. We have two rage spells and a heal spell, guys. Why don't we go ahead and jump into this? and see what can happen, all right? Um, this is gonna be the first of my one unit series. I don't even know if it's gonna be a series because everybody does one unit things. <clears throat> and I don't really wanna copy everyone else, but I had a request to do all hog riders and I thought that it might be kind of funny. Um, so let's see if we can find ourselves a base that is worthy of um, spending all of this dark elixir on. <laughs> I think this would be pretty fun. I've never done a one unit um, attack or anything like that, especially not made a video on it. So we'll see how this turns out. I think that it could be um, relatively interesting to see what happens. Um, but I'm not even really sure what kind of base I'm looking for. I definitely don't want it to be a fully upgraded Town Hall 9 or 10, obviously, because these troops wouldn't fare too well against that. But hopefully we can find ourselves maybe a, um, a medium level Town Hall 8 or something along those lines that we can attack that has a pretty good amount of resources that we can steal. Um, this one doesn't look that bad. It's just huge. Um, it is <clears throat> about 8 o'clock in the morning where I am. So it's still a little bit early for me, especially on a Saturday. But we're going to see what we can do. That one would have been... <clears throat> excuse me. That one would have been perfect, but... Um, there were practically no resources in it. Same with that one right there. Um, but anyways, guys, why don't you comment below if you want me to keep doing one unit things. I know that people like them and they're interesting, uh, especially when you fail at them. Um, so comment below if you want me to keep doing that. Also, like the video and subscribe if you haven't, guys. Um, and we will continue looking. Another little announcement for you guys is I just posted another video on my design channel, Design with Molt. So go check that out. Um, I'm going to be doing giveaways on there every once in a while um, of design stuff so that you can have cover artwork and whatnot for your YouTube channel if you are trying to grow. Um, so go check that out, Design with Molt, guys. Um, I'm subscribed to him on this channel, so you can just go look in my uh, feature thing and you will see that channel right there. Let's look for a little bit longer <clears throat> and see what we can find. If we don't find anything soon, then I will cut out, um, but we'll give it a couple more seconds. Well, hopefully more than a couple more seconds. <laughs> Alright, so this one, dang it, that one, uh, yeah, we're not going to do that. That one tower was not full. Um, the one Inferno Tower. But all the Expos in that other Inferno Tower were, so we probably couldn't have done too well on that. You know, this one might not work too bad. There are a bunch of Expos in there. Um, but let's see. Why don't we attack from the top up here and um, see we can't get into the center, all right? So we're just going to go ahead and drop all these guys right here. We use our Barb King too. And then let's see, they're going to be running around. I want to get some of them inside the center, hopefully. Hopefully, we can get a whole bunch of them in the center. I don't really don't want them to just rotate around. That would suck really, really bad. Here we go. Right, so, those guys are going in the center. So are these guys right here. And then let's drop a heal spell where we think they're going to be going. And hopefully, they can run up into that. Um, so, all the hog runners up at the top are done for. The ones down here at the bottom are still working their way around. Um, some of them are working their way into the middle. One of those expos is full. The other one is empty. We still have a whole bunch of hog riders down here, guys. Um, it looks like my Barbarian King is done for up there. We're going to go ahead and drop the last of our hog riders right here. And it looks like they will continue rotating around. Um, this is actually going fairly well. looks like both of his, um, both of his expos are actually out of ammunition now. Um, so, now that they are inside, since I've never done this before, I would have waited with my heal and my rage spell, um, until this point, but it looks like they're still doing pretty good damage, um, being hilarious, jumping around. We have 66% right now. I don't think we're going to make it to the town hall, 
but it does look like um, we will get a okay amount of resources. Um, the Hog Riders don't have too much health. It looks like they can get taken down in, um, shoot, I don't know, like five hits or so. This guy is just ticking away at this, which is actually pretty good because he's getting about a thousand, or actually he's getting more than a thousand per hit. So that is awesome. That's what we're looking for. Um, he's almost done over there. Let's see where he moves. All right, now he's in range of that cannon, so he's going to get taken out in about three shots. And that's going to be it, guys, for this one-unit series. That is not a bad raid at all. I am perfectly fine with that. Eight trophies, 180,000 gold, 134,000 elixir, and 819 dark elixir, which paid for a whole lot of those... Um, a whole lot of the hog riders so that's it guys that's the first of the one unit series i hope that you liked it comment down below as to what you want the second one unit series to be and i will try and make that happen for you guys all right thank you so much for watching as always i appreciate it you guys are awesome you are so much cooler than me keep calm and clash on for me i'll see you guys later